this is Tara for HealingCrystals.com and this is your astrology report for the week of January 28th through February 3rd. On Wednesday and Thursday we have a lot of creative adventurous energy and you want to use that energy to go and try new things. If there's something you've been thinking about trying, something you think you might be interested in, now's the time to go and take a look at it because it may develop into a passion that you're going to want to explore more and develop more fully as we move on throughout the year. The month is going to end, can you believe January is almost over? The month is going to end with a Venus Saturn square that is going to bring up doubt. You could be questioning the things that you want and your ability to be able to get those things that you want. We've had a lot of this kind of energy over the last few weeks. Just remember that the purpose isn't to make you feel depressed or to make you feel like you can't do something or to make you give up. The purpose is to help you realize what is most important to you and focus on those things. And realize that if it is that important to you, that you can get past anything that's in your way. And that's the kind of energy that you want to take with you as you move into February. There's a lot of very exciting, inspirational energy that um, February is going to start off with. And one of my favorite transits is with, the, is with Pluto and the Sun, and that's going to be on February 3rd. And that's just going to make everything seem new and fresh and exciting. And it, it's going to be like a big burst of energy, and you're going to respond really well to it. And, and it's, it's going to make you just want to go out and... and do exciting things and that's that's a great way to start off any month so here's the crystals that i'm going to be carrying with me this week first of all i have a green adventurine to keep my self-confidence intact and to remind me that i can achieve anything um, i'm carrying a rose quartz because rose quartz makes me smile and i think it makes other people smile and that just changes the energy of everything. So if, you know, the days are kind of dark and long and, you know, the groundhog's going to be showing up in a couple of days and we'll see what happens there. But, you know, it's, it's this time of year, it can be a little tough and a rose quartz always makes everything better. It just surrounds everything with a happy pink energy. And then finally, I'm carrying Botswana Agate, um, one of my absolutely favorite crystals because I like how there's always kind of a swirl in there and I think it keeps energy flowing in a positive direction. It reminds me that I am part of that energy and I need to remain positive and keep that energy flowing. Don't forget to check out our weekly and daily horoscopes on HealingCrystals.com and on our Facebook page, Crystal Talk. Have a wonderful and exciting week.